Welcome to the December 2016 issue of What's Up in Paris. This monthly magazine is dedicated to everything you need to experience, see, listen to and do in Paris. Stay with us for What's Up in Paris selection of key events during the festive season. The question comes up every year, where am I going to see in the new year on the 31st of December? If you haven't decided, What's Up in Paris offers you two options. Option one, if you're looking for an oriental intimate club atmosphere, try the Casper in Rue de la Forge Royale in the 11th arrondissement. The programme includes R&B, house pop, dance hall and tropical reggae. From 11pm to dawn with croissant at 5am and of course there's dinner. For full details of the evening, which will cost you 200 euros, go to the Casper FR. Option two, more traditional, very chic and more expensive, the pre-Catalan and elegant Napoleon III pavilion with a classy decor in the Bois de Boulogne where you can enjoy a real New Year's Eve menu for 600 euros. Caviar, scallops, lungustines, lobster, etc. all interpreted and concocted by a three-star chef, Frédéric Anton. Book on restaurant lepricatalan.com. Take advantage of the school holidays to take your children to see the creations of the man who gave life to Mickey Mouse and Donald Duck and so many other characters. Hundreds of the works from the Walt Disney Studios will be on show in an exhibition entitled Movement Through Nature at the Art Ludique Museum in collaboration with Walt Disney Animation Research Library. For further information, artludique.com slash Disney. At the Opera Library and Museum, lovers of dance and painting will no doubt want to see the exhibition dedicated to Leon Basque, one of the leaders of the avant-garde group of the Russian artists belonging to the World of Art movement. The main artist to work with the Russian ballet during its seasons, he designed the sets and costumes of several masterpieces, Chesarade, Le Spectre de la Rose, La Après Midi de la Fond and Daphne and Chloe. His work revolutionised not only theatre decoration but also fashion and decorative arts. To book your seats, bnf.fr. Listen, Notre Dame de Paris, the famous musical by Luc Pladon and Richard Cossianti, returns to the stage 15 years after the last performance with 10 million spectacles around the world. This musical adapted from Victor Hugo's book is etched in the memory for its magical story and its songs such as Belle and La Tombe de Cathedral. The show makes its triumph return this year to the Palais de Congrès until the 8th of January, so don't miss it. Bookings, Notre Dame de Paris, spectacle.com. You have until the 31st of December to go to the Palais and see the rock pop opera, who adapted from a great work of literature, this time Stendhal's The Red and Black. With its projection of 3D images, the show is innovative in the world of musicals. For further information, larougelenoir.fr. Do. From the 14th of December to the 2nd of January 2017, why not take your children ice skating? Where? In central Paris. In the Grand Palais, which will be home to the famous Christmas skating rink measuring over 2,700 metres squares. For the adults, the Grand Palais de Grasse will also be offering night openings every evening until 2am, along with entertainment and light shows, shows on ice happening and DJ nights are all back again this year. If you're tempted, go to Le Grand Palais desglaces.com. And to give even more pleasure to your children, don't forget to get them in touch with Christmas magic at Disneyland Paris. In the company of the Snow Queen, the Disney Prince and Princesses, Mickey and Minnie Mouse and Father Christmas. For further information, DisneylandParis.fr. Have a great Christmas and New Year in Paris. We'll be back again in early 2017.